Good morning, stars. Corey here. And I'm Dallas here to share the fabulous Friday news. Today is Friday, April 5th. And it's a B3 day for special area classes. Have a fantastic Friday, stars. It's also Friendship Friday. Sometimes it's hard for people to make friends. If you're one of those people, try using some of these tips. You may not be the only one who feels lonely. If you see someone by themselves, go and talk to them. Tell them your name and ask them some questions to get to know them. Do they have pets? What's, your favorite, what's their favorite color? Do they play any sports? Make sure to be kind and respectful. They won't want to be your friend if you're not kind. Be, be good, good friends, friend stars. We don't have school on Monday because of the eclipse. On Monday, there will be a total solar eclipse. That means the sun will pass between the sun and the earth. It will get almost as dark as night in the middle of the afternoon. There won't be another total eclipse in Indiana until 2153, so you better watch this one. I don't think any of us will be alive in 130 years from now. Stay tuned after the pledge to watch a video from NASA. It's time to celebrate birthdays. Happy birthday to Raquel Dixon and Lucy Prala. Our weekend birthdays are Caroline Rivera, Caroline Shu, Joshua Cunningham, and Ms. Sabinski. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! Time for lunch. You can have a pasta with meat sauce and garlic bread. Or a stuffed crust pizza. Have, have a, a good, good lunch, lunch, stars! Let's hear a joke. Where do bad rainbows go? I don't know. Where? Prism. <laughs> Great joke. Please send us more. Put in the joke box by the library or type it and send it to abtvjokes at gmail.com. It seems our time is up. We have Miss Oliver's class here to lead us to pledge. Have a good weekend, stars. Hi, my name is Savvy. Hi, my name is Hope. My name's Mara. My name is Maflick. I'm a lipstick ball. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. It's the middle of the day, so why is the sky getting dark? It's a solar eclipse. A solar eclipse happens when, at just the right moment, the moon passes between the sun and earth. Sometimes the moon only blocks part of the sun's light. This is called a partial solar eclipse. Other times, the moon blocks all of the sun's light. This is called a total solar eclipse. As the moon blocks the sun's light, it casts a shadow on part of the Earth. The moon's shadow creates a trail as the Earth rotates. This trail is called the path of totality. If you want to experience darkness during an eclipse, you have to be in the path of totality. In that path, the moon completely blocks the sun's light for a few minutes. It gets so dark that it looks like nighttime during a full moon. If you don't know what's happening, it can be confusing. Animals can get confused too. But this darkness can also be kind of cool for scientists who study the sun's atmosphere, called the corona. The corona is very dim. It's usually hard to see because the sun is so much brighter. But when the moon blocks the sun's light during an eclipse, all you can see is the light from the corona. Total solar eclipses over the land, where people can see them, don't happen very often. But when they do happen, the moon gives scientists, and the rest of us, a glimpse at the corona's beautiful streams and ribbons. Thanks, moon. Find out more about the sun at NASA Space Place.